guys and welcome back to another video this is Liz and today I have a special little treat for you I have another tag now I haven't done these tags in so long you guys and this is a summer tag called this or that summer tag now I saw this on a channel called mama cat that's cat with a K TV mama cat TV Okay, I gotta get my throat together. I'm like clearing it. <laughs> but anyway, there are 14 questions and it's just a cute little summer tag to do if you guys like tags and I am one that loves to do tags. So we're gonna get started. Number one, these are very quick and short questions so this won't take me too long. Okay, number one says ocean or pool? Well, I would choose pool any day. Even though I can't swim, I don't know how to swim, no I don't, but I don't like the ocean, especially these days with all that, uh, what is that, seaweed and all of the <laughs> diseases and germs and just stuff nowadays, you know, you don't want to get in the ocean these days. So I would choose pool any day. Number two, beach, vacation, or wilderness? Ooh, well, let's see. I don't like either one, but I would have to say beach vacation. Now, that does not mean that I have to get in the uh, beach water, but um, I wouldn't mind a beach vacation if I had to choose it, uh, because there's a number of things you can do. You can walk on the, the boardwalk of the beach and just enjoy the scenery, you can go into some of the nice uh, little shops and, you know, do some nice shopping. You know, there's things you can do. Go to a nice little restaurant and eat, uh, do some fun activities, maybe in the sand, you know, play with a beach ball. Uh, I'm not opposed to doing that. Maybe exercise, you know. But those of us who like to exercise, I don't like to exercise, but, you know, I do exercise for health-wise. But anyway, and I definitely will not choose the wilderness because I am not into that lifestyle. <laughs> so, beach vacation is it. Number three, watermelon or strawberries? Oh, I love both of them. Oh, that's a hard question because I love both, both of them. Uh, I'm going to choose watermelon because watermelon is full of water and you can get full off of that and it's so good. And uh, so I'll choose watermelon. On the other hand, if I were to choose strawberries, I like to make smoothies with it. So I got to choose both, but it says or, so watermelon is it. Number four, bikini or one piece? Now. <laughs> <laughs> when I read that question, bikini, and I haven't had my body in a bikini in so long, so we're going to just strike bikini, okay? Um, and just go with a one, a one piece. I think one piece would suit my body much better than a bikini any day, okay? So, especially having two children, uh, I think one piece would do it. <laughs> Yeah, we, we can't, we won't go there with the bikini. Oh boy, that, I like that question. Number five, lemonade or iced tea? I like both, but I would choose lemonade any day because I love lemons and I love the taste of lemonade, especially a strawberry lemonade. That is so good. And you can do so many things with lemonade, put so many different things in there, make it get real creative, you know? So lemonade is it. Six, hot dogs or, gotta wear my specs, hot dogs. Okay, they're asking you, do you like hot dogs? And if you do, grilled or over a fire? Well, for me, guys, you know I don't eat meat at all. No meat, not even tuna. So, but if I were eating it, when I used to eat it, um, I'll just speak for how I used to do when I used to eat it. Um, either way, I would have taken it grilled or over a fire. Either way, but probably over a fire. 
But you know what? I'm so glad I don't, I don't eat meat anymore. I mean, I feel so much better. I really do. I feel lighter and uh, it's healthier, so. Okay, moving right along. Number seven, hat or sunglasses. Ah, uh, well, for me, I have to have, I don't have to have both. So I would choose sunglasses. When I go out of my house, I gotta have my glasses at all times. And although hat is nice, I like wearing hats sometimes, but sometimes, you know, I like to wear nice, you know, my hairdos, my long hair, like today, I like to wear them. And you know what, speaking of hair, I've gotta come up with a nice name for hair like this. So if you guys can think of a nice name, something cute, um, some people say girlfriends, uh, they call their hair girlfriends, but I'm trying to think of a nice cute name for my different hairdos like this. So if you can think of one, please leave me a comment down below. I really appreciate it. Eight, windows, windows down or air condition <laughs> on all the way. Well, 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 now that varies for me. It depends on the temperature. If it's in the summer, well, we were talking about summer, so I guess I, I need to answer it, you know, for summer. Um, I'm gonna say both. You know, it's kind of hard to give a one answer to this because sometimes I get cold with the air conditioning on so cold, crisp. Um, mm, but you gotta choose one. Okay. Just make it simple. Windows, no, not windows. Air condition. Air condition all the way. But with a qualifier, I must be able to turn that thing down and get warm because I get cold. But anyway, and my family loves the air condition, especially my husband. I mean, he's more hotter. He gets more hotter than I do. And I think generally men typically get hotter than women anyway. So. He has to have his on all the time. Number nine, tanning lotion or sunscreen. Well, oh boy. I think these questions are hard because it's hard for me to choose one over the other. Uh, I can go either way. I'm not really trying to get tan, you guys, for the summer. I used to try to get tan a lot and try to get nice and bronze, but you know what? I gave it up long time ago because when the winter comes when the fall comes what happens the tan goes away so what's the use in trying to tan your body it doesn't last so i'm gonna say sunscreen sunscreen is it because <clears throat> you want to protect your skin against skin cancer and all that all that goes with that so sunscreen and it's more healthier anyway 10, baseball games or concert? Well, that's easy. <laughs> a concert. <laughs> oh, that was very easy. I love concerts. Uh, I would love to go to, um, well, certain types of musical uh, concerts. I love uh, classical music, so I would love to go to a concert like that with uh, classical music or jazz concerts. I love jazz concerts, um, even ballet concerts, anything like that. Okay, 11, we're almost done. Ice cream or popsicles? Uh, well, I'll have to choose popsicles, uh, even though I have not had popsicle in ages. I don't eat ice cream, dairy, well, that type of dairy anymore. So popsicles is it. I love the tropical colors and my favorite one of a popsicle is that have you ever tried that big stick it's called big stick and they're so good it's like red and a little bit of orange like um, tangerine color though or mango color it's mixed in together it's so so good number 12 fireworks or fireflies fireflies do you guys know what fireflies are uh, if I'm not mistaken, I think fireflies are flies with fire in them. That's what I heard. Um, I don't like either one, but I'll choose fireworks. 
but the legal kind, okay? The ones you go to the show, not those illegal ones that you buy from those stands. Right, number 13, flip flops or, oh, flip flops or bare feet. Um, I like both. <laughs> See, it's hard to choose one or the other. Flip flops. Uh, there's days when I like to have flip flops on to give my feet some support. And there are days where I just want to be downright barefooted. So, let's see, one or the other. Mm, ah, flip flops. <laughs> That's kind of hard. I don't know. Flip flops. Okay. And the last and final question: water balloons or squirt guns? Um, that's a hard one too. I don't really, I don't have a squirt gun. Um, I think squirt guns may be fun. You know, you can get out in your backyard and pretend like you're, you know, squirting the water at your family. That may be fun and it might be dangerous too. Um, probably a water balloon. That sounds less um, dramatic, <laughs> although it's fun and you can get you know, you can get all watered, watered up, that's for sure. Um, I think water, buns, water balloons would be a lot more fun. You know, you throw it at the person, uh, especially on your grass, and just, just have a, you know, a lot of fun. So, water balloons is it. Okay guys, that's it. That was the 14 question tag. Yes, 14 questions. So, I am tagging you, if you are watching, this video and you have a youtube channel please do this tag it's a very fun tag and um as you know i love doing tags so if anybody has a nice tag that they think that i will be interested in you can always feel free to invite me to do it and i'll see i'll check it out so anyway you're tagged if you're watching this video that's all i have for you today i will see you guys next time i hope that you have enjoyed it please subscribe before you leave and give me a big thumbs up and leave me a comment down below and let me know what you think of the tag, okay? Okay guys, you have a blessed day and I will see you next time in my next video. Bye.